day. How y'all wear all that stuff and stuff? Well, it was raining yesterday, but it's a chance of raining today, but the sun out and it's back hot and humid. <laughs> y'all, I got stuff good for you today. We have our Taco Tuesday on a Sunday, okay? So, this, you know, if you want to watch this video and make this for Taco Tuesday, it's real easy and it tastes good. But before we get into it, before I tell you what it is, because you hear, you hear this meat already sizzling. <laughs> y'all. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, comment, hit that like button. Also, hit the bell so you can be notified every time I come on, y'all. And look, today, we are going to make a taco hash brown casserole. Something real simple, y'all. Go to get it in this pan. I ain't trying to waste your time. Look in that pan. We got a pound of ground beef in here because I was trying to go ahead and get started because some people just impatient. <laughs> but y'all doing all right. Is y'all doing all right today? That is good. That is good. And if you ain't doing all right, it's still early. It, you know, it just depends on where you at in the world. <laughs> if it's too late in the day, you it'll be better tomorrow. Okay? So I'm just crushing this gr uh, ground beef up. Crushing it up. This is real simple and it tastes good and it will get your belly full. So if you want to make this Tuesday, I'm doing it early for you. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to season this up. I'm going to use a little seasoned salt. Now, if you don't want any of these seasons in your ground beef, you don't have to. I'm just showing you what I'm doing. Put a little seasoned salt. I'm going to put a little garlic powder. Yeah, y'all. It feels it feel kind of a little hot today. <laughs> put a little onion powder. What y'all cooking today on this good old Sunday? Huh? Get you a little complete seasoning. Put that off in there. Y'all made me forget my spoon. Get my spoon. Stir it up. Yeah, what y'all cooking today? Y'all cooking anything good? Something quick? So you can get out and go to the park or something? Get some of that good old vitamin D from the sun? Yeah, y'all. Just... Go ahead and stir this up. Get that season incorporated. Then I'm going to put an onion in here. This is a this kind of like a, a big onion, but you don't have to put all that onion in there if you want. But I love onions, so I'm going to put that onion in there. I'm going to also put uh, a tablespoon of garlic, minced garlic, but I'm going to wait till the last minute to do that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's smelling good. You know it's smelling good. Hold on. Let me crush it up a little more. Try to get them big chunks. But y'all been doing all right out there. How hot is it where you at? Is it hot or is it kind of cool? <laughs> is it kind of cool? Are y'all having storms where you at? It seems like it's everywhere. What y'all doing for the 4th of July? Talk to me. What y'all doing? Y'all making up some uh, good old recipes to do for the 4th. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead, let this finish browning up. And I'm going to drain that grease off. And I'm going to show you what we're going to do next. Go ahead and preheat your oven to 375, okay? Preheat your oven to 375. So, I'm going to go ahead and let this cook because you don't want no pink in this now. No pink. No pink allowed. So, we're going to let that <laughs> cook up and then we're going to drain that grease off and then I'm going to be back. Okay? I'll be back. Okay, y'all. So, I already drained. I'm back. <laughs> okay, I already drained the hamburger meat. So, now I'm going to put a tablespoon of minced garlic in here. Get that all stirred in and fragrant. Oh, right went. Right Y'all play too much. Try to make me mess up. Try to make me mess up. Oh, this smells good. Y'all smell it. Oh, it smells good. Okay, now I'm going to put a can of Rotel in here. Now, this is optional. You don't have to if you don't want to. Well, all of it is optional. <laughs> all of it is optional. 
I'm gonna go ahead and turn off my eye. Okay, now I'm gonna put a can of cheddar cheese soup. Put that off for now. Okay. Ooh, that's another good. Quit playing with her. Quit playing with her. Okay, stir that off in there good. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. So now I'm going to uh, put this to the side and we're going to work on them uh, frozen hash browns I got, okay? So give me a second. I'm going to, uh, well, it ain't going to really be a second of you. It's going to be like we just rolling off in there. <laughs> Okay, y'all, I'm back. Okay, now I'm going to put a little season. This is 30 ounces of frozen uh, hash browns. It, I let it sit out for a little bit so it's not completely froze. But you know what I'm talking about. From the frozen food section. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to put a little black pepper. You don't have to season your potatoes if you don't want to, but I want to. And don't be saying that's too much seasoning because that's in your house. And my house is not enough. <laughs> Put a little season salt and put a little complete season. I'm going to stir this up. Just stir it up. Now, now we're going to put a pack of taco season or you can make your own. I'm trying to make this easy, so we're gonna put this pack in here. All right, stir that in. Here go the part where they say it's too much season. <laughs> okay, then we gonna put, you can put either a half a cup of sour cream in here, or if you wanna put a little less, half a cup. Or if you don't want no sour cream, you don't have to put sour cream in here. Okay. We're going to stir it up some more anyway when we, uh, we're going to put our meat mixture with it. Now, if you want to layer this, you can also, but I'm just going to mix all mine together. So I'm going to put half a bag of shredded cheese in here. And then we're gonna use the other half to top it off. Okay, you see how easy this is? Do you see? Real quick, this is a real quick Tuesday meal. Okay. Now we're gonna put our meat mixture that we just got through fixing. Hold on. Put that out for now. She is cute. You just gotta give me a minute. Give me a minute. Just give me a minute. She cute. Hold on. Stir that off for now. Ooh, it smell good. Quit playing with her. I'm preheating my oven right now. I was telling y'all to preheat y'all oven and forgot the preheat bag. <laughs> okay. That off in there good. Oh, it's already looking cute, and she's not even cooked yet in the oven. Make sure you get all the potatoes incorporated. Okay, now get you whatever dish you want to get casserole dish, or I'm getting a little pan to make it easy for cleanup. And then we're just going to pour it in here. Ooh, that was a big thing. <laughs> I did that like I was angry. <laughs> y'all play too much. I ain't fooling with y'all today on this Sunday. Uh-uh, not today on this Sunday. Maybe on a Friday, but I ain't playing with y'all today. 
Okay. Now you just, you know, kind of mash her down a little bit so she can look cute. Okay. Now we're going to put that shredded cheese on top. Boom. And if you want to, you could crush up some uh, Fritos and put it on top too. It just You can just do whatever you want to with this dish. Put it in them corners. Okay, that's my oven preheated. 375. We're going to put this in the oven for about 40, 45 minutes till your cheese get good and bubbly. Okay. And bam, we, that's what we're going to do. And I'm going to take, I'll show you how she look after I take out the oven. Okay, I'll be back. Hey, y'all, I'm back. And I'll finish with this taco hash brown casserole. <laughs> y'all, I ain't going to hold you. Gotta look at her. Look at her. Y'all saw how easy it was to make it. Look how cute she is. She cute. Y'all thought she was going to be cute. <laughs> look at her. Quit playing with her. I put a little sour cream, a little dollop of sour cream over there. And I put a little parsley, little flakes on there. She cute. Quit playing with her. But look, y'all. <laughs> Thank y'all so much for tuning in to the... You try to sabotage me and mess me up. <laughs> Thank y'all for tuning in this Sunday, y'all. You almost said Tuesday because it's Taco Tuesday. But you can make this for Taco Tuesday. It's real simple and quick and easy. Just put everything in a bowl and mix on up. But look, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, comment, and hit that like button. Also, hit the bell to be notified. Y'all, please stay safe out there. I love you, and I'm going to see you again next time. Bye-bye.